No, Mark, one question. Yeah. In one word, how would you describe my upcoming trip? Reckless. Good morning. So today is my day off and I thought this is the perfect opportunity to take you through the day with me and whilst I do that, I'll fill you in on what's been happening and more importantly, on what is going to happen very soon. But first, I need a proper Aussie breakfast. So at first, I really didn't like Vegemite. I thought it was the most disgusting thing I'd ever eaten. But now, I really, really do enjoy it. It's yummy. Even though we're well and truly in the middle of autumn now, the weather's just fabulous. We've got 27 degrees, the sun is shining. It's awesome, so I'm having breakfast out here in the garden. Which reminds me, I still have some footage of us working on this part of the garden, which I haven't shown you yet. Alrighty, Mark and I were finally taking care of parts of our garden. Um, this was a pond, and it was very overgrown. And now, we're fixing it up. Some progress has been made. We're now in for the final kill. Yep. <laughs> Wish us luck, we're gonna bend this. There's a very big root. I'm going to show the people what we're up against. Ah, this is the root we need to get through. It's the root of all evil. It is. the pond centre now because we have gotten so far with our garden project that we can now put a new pond liner in. This is the stuff we're after. Pond liner. Look, he's got it. <laughs> new day, further developments with the pond. Mark's got it all levelled out, he thinks. The liner's going in. And I'm doing nothing. <laughs> Look, it's a rainbow. It's a That's rushes. nice. But I have now I had to change into my actual work outfit because I have to help now to cut the dirt. So I didn't anticipate for that. I'm not happy. Mark's been fighting the rain. Yeah. And look what he did. Yeah. He put the border around. Look, the rain filled it up already quite a bit. Gonna feed the fish now. Ready? Let's see if they come. So the past few weeks have been quite hectic and busy. Mark and I are renovating our bathroom. Had a small surgery. Hello. <laughs> I'm stuffed with strong painkillers and opioids <laughs> and I'm looking forward to not feeling like shit anymore. <laughs> oh. All right. No, I can open my eyes. Just. All right, I'll see you later. Cheers. <laughs> and I started to organize my next trip. Right now though, I'm having to go down to Fremantle because even though it's my day off, I'm still having to do something work related. I don't think I've ever told you, but um, I'm a psychologist and a counsellor and to continue being a registered counsellor I need to fulfil like certain professional development requirements like supervision for example so this is what I'm going to do now I'm going to supervision to my supervisor in Fremantle I know I need fuel too
vision is done. And now I'm really hungry. So on my way home, I might stop off in Cottesloe and get myself some lunch. All right, here I am in good old Cottesloe. Got myself some lunch and I'm enjoying the ocean view. The behind me is heaps and heaps of surfers learning to surf, I think. I think it's a surf school. I'm now heading back to the house and I'm going to go and meet up with Mark for a bit of a coffee. But just before, I need, I need to go and organise something for my upcoming trip, which I still have to tell you about. Who's here? Woo! It's Mark. Yeah. He's alive. He's eating chocolate. I have a picnic, everyone. <laughs> what do you think of my upcoming trip? I think it's reckless, everyone. I think it's. I think it's crazy. I think it's like Why? the plot of Wolf Creek, <laughs> like told from Suzanne's perspective. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's not that bad. My mum's terribly worried. Is she? Yep. She, I'm going to come up and have a talk to that girl. <laughs> Too late. What is Can't your mum's attitude? Is that it? They're worried. There you go. The mums are worried. All right. That's it. You can eat your chocolate. All right. Thank goodness. <laughs> you too. Thank you. Now, for the end of the day, I've come down to the beach for the sunset. It's beautiful. Okay, so what's the plan? The plan is that on my next trip, I'm going to go all by myself, all the way up first to Exmouth, and then from Exmouth inland to Kerry Jimmy National Park. I think a round trip, I think it is about a round trip of about 4,000 kilometers. <laughs> I'm going to do that by myself. I'm going to be camping most of the time. Um, I'll be swimming with whale sharks. I'll hope to get to see some dingoes and just explore that remote area. It is very remote. It's not much on the way, so I needed to get some provisions. I need um, fuel, fuel canisters, I need water canisters. Um, uh, th there won't be much power on the way on the camping ground, so I need power banks. I got myself a nice solar charger. So I'm prepared, <laughs> I'm doing it all by myself, this is going to be super interesting. And then after that, Mark and I will do a trip together again. We'll be getting on a little plane and we'll be flying to Thailand. And right now, I'm going to watch this beautiful sunset which you can't see. I'll show you in a minute. I'm going to say goodbye to you for now and I'll see you on my adventure which will be starting very, very, very soon. Okay, bye! Tschüss!